Hi Fields friends, happy first day of kindergarten. I have a special tradition. On the first day of school every single year, I read the same book to my class. So I have read this book to five different classes in kindergarten, in first grade, and in second grade. And I'm so excited to share this book with you guys today. This book is called First Day Jitters. Jitters is that silly feeling that you feel in your tummy when you're feeling nervous or scared about something. You're, you might feel some jitters in your body and it just means you're a little nervous. And a lot of the times on the first day of school, we all have those jitters way down deep. So I hope that you put your confetti under your pillow last night and that helped get rid of some of your jitters. And I hope today we can get rid of some of your jitters with this story also. First day jitters. Sarah dear, time to get out of bed, Mr. Hartwell said, poking his head through the bedroom doorway. You don't want to miss the first day at your new school, do you? I'm not going, said Sarah, and pulled the covers over her head. Of course you're going, honey, said Mr. Hartwell, as he walked over to the window and snapped up the shade. My family does that to me when I won't wake up. They just turn on the lights and they say, time to get up. No, I'm not. I don't want to start over again. I hate my new school, Sarah said. She tunneled down to the end of her bed. How can you hate your new school, sweetheart? Mr. Hartwell chuckled. You've never been there before. Don't worry. You liked your other school. You'll like this one. Besides, just think of all the new friends you'll meet. That's just it. I don't know anybody, and it will be hard, and I just hate it, and that's all. Can you show me me too if you're worried about not making friends at your new school? That gives me the jitters. What will everyone think if you aren't there? We told them you were coming. They will think that I'm lucky and they will wish that they were at home in bed like me, Mr. Hartwell sighed. Sarah Jane Hartwell, I'm not playing this silly game one second longer. I'll see you downstairs in five minutes. Sarah tumbled out of bed. She stumbled into the bathroom. She fumbled into her clothes. My head hurts, she moaned as she trudged into the kitchen. Mr. Hartwell handed Sarah a piece of toast and her lunchbox. They walked to the car. Sarah's hands were cold and clammy. They drove down the street. She couldn't breathe. Oh, she's got a lot of jitters. And then they were there. I feel sick said Sarah weakly. Nonsense, said Mr. Hartwell. You'll love your new school once you get started. Oh, look, there's your principal, Mrs. Burton. Sarah slumped down in her seat. Oh, Sarah, Mrs. Burton gushed, peeking into the car. There you are. Come on, I'll show you where to go. She led Sarah into the building and walked quickly through the crowded hallways. Don't worry, everyone is nervous on the front day. first day, she said over her shoulder as Sarah rushed to keep up. Can you guys look really close at this picture? When you see the principal, will you touch your nose? Good job, there's the principal right there. When they got to the classroom, most of the children were already in their seats. class looked up at Mrs. Burton, the principal, as she cleared her throat. <coughs> class, class, attention please, said Mrs. Burton. When the class was quiet, she led Sarah to the front of the room and said, class, I would like you to meet 
your new teacher, Mrs. Sarah Jane Hartwell. That book surprised me. I thought Sarah was a student and she was so nervous for her first day at school, but Sarah was the teacher. Miss Sarah was nervous about her first day of school and she was the teacher. I'm feeling just like Sarah right now in this book. I have been feeling the jitters so deep down about the first day of school and I'm the teacher. So I know you as the students are also feeling nervous. We're gonna take some time today to draw what we're nervous about. So in your bag that I gave you at the pickup parade, you have a paper that looks like this, except on your paper, there's no drawings on there. In just a second, when you're finished with my video, you're gonna have a chance to do this paper all on your own. At the top, you're gonna write your name. I wrote Miss Fields, but are you gonna write Miss Fields on your paper? No, you're gonna write your name. And I want you to draw something that you're nervous about. Draw a picture of something that makes you scared with school, something that makes you get the jitters way down deep in your tummy. I drew a computer because I'm really, really nervous about teaching on the computer. It makes me get jitters deep, 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 deep in my tummy. And I also drew my students because I'm nervous and I really, really hope that my students love me as much as I love them. So now when this video is over, I want you to find this paper and take some time to draw what you're nervous about. I would love if you could take a picture and post it on Seesaw so that I can see what you're nervous about too. Okay, Fields friends, have a great time drawing your pictures. I hope the rest of the day you get rid of all those jitters. See you soon.